Amanda welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another quarantine vlog so today we have a couple things to do we need to do our nails I got some clothing that I wanted to show you we're gonna be doing a little white fox try on haul I'm so excited that they partnered with me for this video I'm gonna be showing you some of the pieces I've been wearing because I have had them for a while and I just haven't shown you guys so I really want to show you guys so we're gonna make breakfast first and then we'll get on with the rest of the day so Let's do it. All right, guys, for breakfast today, we're making some avocado toast with a side of mango. So I'm gonna cut up this mango because it's perfect for cutting right now. And I'm just gonna be using half an avocado on one slice of whole grain toast. And I'm also gonna be eating an acai little bar. So basically, it's like acai dipped in dark chocolate. And it's super yummy. I saw it on TikTok, so I bought it at Costco. And we're gonna make some matcha today because I haven't had some in a while. We need some energy. I am exhausted today. I'm also making my lemon water with apple cider vinegar that I make every morning. I didn't use the full half lemon. I squeezed a little bit in there because we're using some lemon juice for the avocado. And now we're gonna be taking two caps of the vinegar. This is really good for you in the morning, like taking a shot of apple cider vinegar, but it's not good to take it just the vinegar. You need to dilute it in water. So I just add lemon and vinegar, mix it up. I don't consider this like breakfast. It's just something I drink beforehand, so. I'm gonna be drinking this while I make the rest of my breakfast. All right, we got our avocado. I'm gonna cut it in half. Oh, all right, now that we got our avocado, we're just gonna spoon it out. Okay, now that we took out the avocado, I'm just going to mash it up with a fork. This is where we take the leftover lemon juice. We just put that lemon juice and mix. A little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. So now I'm just scooping up the avocado and spreading it. There you go. And now we're gonna cut our mango. So in Miami right now, it's like mango season. So like June, July, everyone has like mango trees in their backyard. And now it's like when they fall off and get mangoes. All right, guys, you guys know the drill. So I'm gonna be taking a is it a teaspoon or a tablespoon? I don't really know. I'm taking a spoonful of matcha, pouring it in there. I'm adding a spoonful of sugar. I'm not sure if this works, but I don't want to use a lot of sugar, so I'm just going to add some honey. Now we're going to take some almond milk. You guys can do this with any kind of milk. Oat milk, almond, soy. I just personally like almond and it's the only thing I have right now, so. Now, we pour. And you have a matcha latte. If you guys hear like noise outside, there's nothing I can do about it. They're like mowing or doing some landscaping over there. I'm really sorry about the noise, but I made breakfast. So I haven't had avocado toast in so long and I'm so happy about it. I tried to cut the mango, but this mango has like a lot of hair in it. Like, you know, like the hairy mangoes? I don't know why. I'm so happy I made my matcha today. I made it really good today. So we went to Steph's house yesterday and we hung out there for a little bit and I took Aniela because she hasn't seen the blaze in a while, obviously because she lives up there now. So at like 9.30 I was like, Steph, I have to go home. Like I'm gonna fall asleep like if I stay any longer and drive home afterwards. So I got home and I was so tired that I knocked out and then I woke up in the middle of the night and I couldn't go back to sleep. That's the worst when you go to bed like really early and then like you wake up like in the middle of the night and you don't know whether to stay up or go back to sleep. So I stayed up for like two, three hours and then went back to sleep and I woke up today like really tired. So I need this today. Oh my God, I'm so hungry. <laughs> Look how pretty it came out. I'm just like. So Jeff, my editor, hi Jeff, you're watching this right now, sent me another vlog that we did from two days ago. So I'm gonna look over the footage now as I eat breakfast and we're posting it tomorrow. So I'm just gonna prep it and stuff. Since we're filming so much today, I don't wanna like do too much and overwhelm myself. So today we're filming this vlog and I think we might film a playlist video if we have time, but I'm gonna look over this footage and see if there's anything we need to change. And Annie wanted to go to the pool later, so we'll see what we do. So if you didn't know, 
Now you know. This is my sister Aniela. I've done a video or a few with her before. Yeah. So she's staying with me for the next two weeks. So let us know down below what videos you want to see from us. We're staying at Steph's apartment beach house in Sunny Isles this weekend. So we're going to be like in the beach and just hanging out. I'm going to vlog obviously over there. She Five went times. to meet with a friend earlier. Yeah, we went to IHOP. How do you feel being back in Miami? I'm very happy. You know, like... Obviously, the transitions can be a little weird, but I'm comfortable here now. Like, it just takes some getting used to at first. But I'm fine. This is the first time you're staying with me for like a long time. Yeah, last time I stayed with her, I only stayed with her for a week, but now it's gonna be like a month. Like, like a full weeks. on thing. Wow. I'm still getting used to it. Love that. <laughs> but yeah, yeah, I pay rent by cleaning around here. So. Love that. <laughs> but yeah, you guys, I'm gonna finish breakfast and go over this footage. I'll see you later. All right, guys, so I just finished breakfast, looked over the footage and a bunch of stuff, and I wanted to show you guys actually the pieces that I've been wearing lately because I've been getting so many questions as to where my outfits are from, and lately I've been wearing a lot of White Fox. They're like one of my favorite clothing brands ever, and I wanted to show you guys some of my favorite pieces that I've been wearing nonstop lately, and also some pieces I will be wearing post-quarantine. So the first piece I'm gonna show you guys is this black cocktail dress, which I absolutely have been obsessed with. I can't wait to wear this when Miami finally opens up and there's a cure for this virus I love how form-fitting it is like once you put it on it like completely snatches you because it has like the stretchy fabric for it and I absolutely love the length it's like a little bit over your thigh has like a white box on the straps and like bedazzled and you don't have to wear a bra once you put it on because there are like bralette inserts in them and the fabric is meshed you guys you can't have too many black cocktail dresses there's always one for every occasion I also picked out a couple of these corset tops which I absolutely have been obsessed with I love these corset tops because you can dress them up or dress them down I actually picked them out in three different colors I got them in black I got them in white and I also got it in this pink color which I think is beautiful I don't know why lately I've been loving wearing pink and everybody keeps telling me pink is your color and I'm just like so flattered and this is like a neon pink vibe and I think this is perfect for summer because I love wearing pops of color during summer and you guys I love my neutral colors that you know you can wear with anything I love these because you can wear them with jeans skirts leather pants I absolutely love that you guys can dress these up or dress them down You can definitely accessorize these and it honestly makes an outfit just look so much better And these cinch your waist like they make you look super snatched, which I absolutely love It's like a corset top basically next up. I have this leather bralette I have been wearing this so much. I've never seen anything like this Obviously, I've seen bralettes, but not like leather like this and I love this because you can wear it with jeans You can wear it with leather pants. You guys can definitely dress this up or dress it down You can wear it with sweats like there's there's just so many things you guys can wear this with also with the corset tops I've also worn these with sweatpants next up. We have this jean jacket right here You guys this is such a Coachella jacket. Tell me no I love that it has like the bedazzled things like falling off of it I think it looks super dope and like I said this can tie in an outfit together You guys can dress this up or dress it down This would be such a fit with like the cowboy boots and like the corset top and some shorts And I probably will wear that outfit sometime soon I just have to find like the right occasion for it next up. We have these boots right here here. I don't own anything like this and this is such a Coachella outfit Like I could totally imagine me at Coachella with these boots on and like that jacket the corset top and some shorts Just like running around the desert these boots are so cool And I just have to figure out the right occasion to wear this for because clearly Coachella is not happening this year So I don't know. I just thought these were so dope <laughs> Next up we have this beautiful silk skirt and the inside is like this mesh This is such a comfortable skirt by the way I've been wearing it already like when I go to the keys and I absolutely love this as a cover-up almost because I like to wear it with like a bikini top and then this like when I'm going to the beach or something like I said you can dress this up or dress it down You can wear it on a night out or you can dress it down and wear it like in the daytime and I absolutely love the fabric It's so soft so comfortable and it looks so cute on next up We have this silk dress that I have already worn I I wore it to Steph's graduation, like her home graduation, because we clearly didn't go anywhere. So it literally has like these straps that you tie backwards. So you like insert them here and like, it's like this cool like cross back vibe. And the dress is actually like a midi. And this dress gives me like Italian summer vibes. Like I'm in Positano overlooking like the view of the ocean in this beautiful, gorgeous dress. I don't know. I need to find like a really dope occasion to take a picture in this dress in. This dress is also so comfortable, so soft. I've washed it in my washer and it didn't like deteriorate. And it's stretchy. 
it fits my body really nicely and I just absolutely love the fabric and this is such a beautiful dress and a staple for anyone you just need to have a dress like this in your closet because there's always an occasion for it and it's just so beautiful and elegant next up we have this set right here so it's actually a two-piece set there is a pink top and skirt this is actually a midi skirt and like I said this gives me very similar vibes to the white dress that I just showed you this is definitely something I would wear in Europe and if I would have gone to Italy this summer I would have definitely taken it with me and I love the fabric as well it's also stretchy like that other dress and it comes with this top right here and this top you could actually switch it up so it's like a cross top and once you wear it like this it looks super cute but you could also like flip it back and just wear it as a regular like top if you get what I'm saying I can definitely see myself wearing this top with jeans as well there's different ways that you can like dress this obviously you don't have to wear it with this skirt but this set is just so cute and unique and I love this color on me I feel like it really complements my skin tone and it brings out like the brown in my eyes if that makes any sense and you guys I am just simply obsessed with all of the pieces that white fox sent me thank you guys so much for partnering with me on this video there's so much more stuff that you guys haven't seen that's on their site they're always adding new arrivals so if you guys want to check it out I'm gonna link it down below so you guys can check it out and don't forget to use Amanda 15 for 15% off your purchase I'm going to link the white fox boutique site down below as well I hope you guys enjoyed this little try on haul and now I'm going to get ready for the day because I haven't done my makeup or my hair. Alrighty guys, welcome to my glam room. If it's a little echoey in here, I'm sorry. We're still making renovations. We have to get rid of that and decorate that, but let me know if I should get a couch back there with like a neon sign or something. I don't even know what to do in this room, but I mean, I really wants to go to the pool, so I'm gonna do super light, easy, everyday makeup, which I pretty much do in all my vlogs, but I'm gonna be doing it because we're not doing anything too crazy today, and I wanna take a cute photo today, so I'm just gonna do my makeup. makeup of the day. I'm going to link all the products down below for you guys. I'm going to change really quick and we're going to head over to the pool. I'm going to prepare some snacks and we'll probably have a little bit of a late lunch. So that's what we're going to do. All right, guys. So I just got ready for the pool. I'm going to grab my bag, fill it up with some snacks and stuff and we're out. All right, guys. We just got to stuff's. We're going to get in the pool. You guys are wondering, the photographer behind my Instagram. Always me. Always. I'm gonna take pictures in this little outfit. We're having a pool day. Casa Blé, you know the vibe. Mira's gonna get in the pool too. It's sunny as hell, what the heck? I wish it was like this every day. I know, like, it's I so sunny. Hi, Bella. Oh my goodness, hi. Bella is literally anywhere where we are with food. <laughs> We're eating this it's like... down. She can't reach me if I'm in the middle of the pool. No, she's afraid of the pool. Like she's afraid of water. Look at her, she's back there, living her best life. Steph is here, living her best life too. What's up, girl? Aww, Aww that was cute. No, no food for you. Hi, <laughs> I feel like I'm talking to a baby. Oh! <laughs> she wants to bite your ear. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. Say hi. That's Steph's brother's dog. We stole her for the day. What do you want? No, she's like still teething or something. She loves to bite everything. Guys, she's only five months old. Look how big she is. We're just hanging out by the pool. Aniela is back there. She's right there. She's tanning right now. And me and Steph are in the pool. But yeah, we're just hanging out here. I haven't been inside a pool in so long. And we were I making TikToks, but this pool. 
in a good year. I know, my I, own I can literally remember the last time we were in this pool together. I think I was in this pool, I would say maybe six, seven months ago. I know, I don't even know why like we never used this pool. The lighting is perfect here. We could literally film a video right now, but we can't. There's like nothing we can film right now. We do a little Q&A, but we should have asked, should ask for questions. We could have done like a playlist video. You've been wanting to do that for I don't even know how long. Yeah, I don't know what we're gonna do this weekend. We're trying to decide. Bella, 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 no, not the phone, not the camera, please. Anyways, we're gonna hang out in the pool a little bit. We didn't have lunch today. We've just been snacking. We're not like super hungry, but Steph's mom is making baka frita tonight. And my, my so favorite. That's what we're making I'm for dinner. Evelito, you wanna say hi? Dile hola. That's him, eh? You know, he built my vanity. Love him, king. <laughs> But yeah, you guys, we're just hanging out by the pool. We're being annoying. Love you. Bye. All right, guys, so I just got out of the shower. I'm going to get ready for dinner. Steph's mom is making dinner, so I'm excited about that. We're all just hanging out here. Hello. <laughs> I have the biggest headache right now, and I think it's because I'm dehydrated. And guys, look at how big this water bottle on your abroad is. I'm so confused. Dehydrated. I don't... <laughs> But why is it this big? You have to drink like well, no, I drink like a gallon of water a day. Be careful that it doesn't fall. It's so heavy. All right, I'm gonna throw on something of steps because I didn't bring like a clean change of clothes to just like change into. Unless should I wear my pink outfit again? No. Do what do you think we see? Yeah, like no, We're right? I'm going to Prime One Twelve. Can, can you pass me one? All right guys, I'm gonna change and get ready for dinner. Fit check. I believe I'm going to school with my hoodie, my little Mavericks hoodie. Steph, let me borrow some leggings. And we're headed to dinner. Chef Carmen is back at it again. Oh okay. my god. That's a lot, but okay. This is vaca frita, a little bit of rice, and some avocado. Yum. It's okay, Carmen, thank you. So I just got back home, and I don't know if anyone's parents told them this when they were younger, but I'm inventando. So I'm figuring out whether I want to go to LA or not in the next two weeks. So I think it's happening. I just called Nicolette, and the girls are linking up soon. I'm really excited. I have Annie here staying with me for two weeks, and then when she goes home, I'm going to go back to my second home. I'm really excited. I really miss LA. And... You know, I'm gonna try and be as safe as possible about it. But one of my friends might be taking a private jet from Miami to LA, and I might just hop on that plane too, just so it's safer. We'll see what happens, but I'm eating one of these little acai bars right now. This is the Sambazon acai bites. This is amazing. But yeah, it's 10 p.m., we're really tired. I think I'm just gonna watch Netflix. We'll see what I do. Hey guys. So I just got my candle order from DW Home. So I wanted to show you the candles that I got. If you don't know this, DW Home is basically like the main candle brand at TJ Maxx, Home Goods, you know, the whole spiel. I usually just go to Home Goods and get them um, or TJ Maxx. And I didn't know that you can buy them online until an ad of theirs came up on my Instagram and I was like, what the heck? I need to buy this like today. So I did buy scents that I've never tried before because my favorite candle of theirs, which is Oak Moss Sage, isn't available right now for some reason. Um, but I wanted to show you the candles I got. So I got this because I love vanilla scents. This is Vanille. It's not vanilla, it's Vanille. And this is vanilla and nutmeg mixed into a custard dusted with sugar. This candle reminds me of the holidays. It smells so yummy and the packaging is super cute. So I got this one to put in my room. And I also got the same basically scent in like one of these little oil things. And I'm gonna put this in my living room and I have to open it actually. So we're gonna attempt to do that now. Oh, yes. Okay, so you just have to like, I guess put this in. So I'm gonna put this in the living room. Next up, I already have this candle. Um, I bought this a long time ago at Home Goods, um, so I bought another one because I'm running out of it. This is the Serene candle, and oh, this smells amazing. Um, I will read you the notes. This is a lavender sage candle. I love sage and lavender, so 
This smells so yummy and relaxing and I'm definitely putting this somewhere in my room. And to piggyback off lavender, I got the Lavande candle, which is like lavender. I don't even know what language this is, you know, whatever. So this has very similar notes to Serene, but it has added stuff into it. This is lavender, sage, and rose petals touched by vanilla and musk. It definitely smells like this, but a little sweeter. So this is the Black Rose and Ode number one, rich with fragrance. This is a very luxurious looking and smelling candle. So this is Rose and Ode, whatever the hell Ode is, but it smells really yummy. This just like reminds me of like a very luxurious hotel. These candles are also very inexpensive compared to um, Bath and Body Works, so get on it. And it got to my house so fast. By the way, I'm drinking tea. This is a stress relief tea because your girl's stressed. As I'm talking to you guys, I am importing today's vlog footage because I have to turn it in to my management tomorrow. Um, and I'm also posting a YouTube video tomorrow of a vlog that I got like this morning. I already talked about it, but I'm posting it tomorrow so I have to like make a couple edits. But I'm just drinking my stress relief tea and I'm having another one of these berry bites. These are amazing. Oh my gosh, I'm addicted to these now. This is a problem to be in the vlog. Come on, don't be shy. Nah, uh, I'm, I'm kind of shy. You got me the. I'm not ready to be. You guys have been in my vlog before. I'm not ready to be dancing. You already are. Anyways, look who came to visit me to drop off shit I've left with him. The breakup? <laughs> Hi, Lebanon. I'm not ready to be they showed up at my house at like 2 in the morning. I love it. Also, just a quick note, just to clarify, the two beers on my island are Anthony's, not mine. He showed up with them. Yeah, I just wanted to put that out there. So we're trying these pills that apparently change your um, They're miracle taste brand. buds. And they turn sour into sweet. I bought these on Amazon forever ago, but I'm bored, so. Are you guys gonna do it? No. Come go. I wonder what it tastes like. Anthony, you want one? Honestly, the pill doesn't taste like anything. It doesn't taste like anything. This is what I got. Tastes like a medicine. Are you tricking me into being healthy? No. <laughs> also guys, as I'm letting the pill dissolve, I'm cutting up sweatpants and turning them into shorts. And then I'm gonna try them on. Final review. <laughs> All right, let me try one. I'm scared. Tastes like candy. Oh my god! It does taste sweet. Very sweet. Like, I can't stop eating them. No, I, I can stop. <laughs> I can stop eating them. Do you want another one? It's like really sweet. It tastes like. It's really good though. The shorts came out cute, by the way. I just realized I forgot to film an outro for this video, but I wanted to say thank you guys so much for watching. I love you all so much. Be sure to like and subscribe down below if you haven't already and join the family. We're so close to 600k, which is crazy. And if you guys want to check out White Fox, I'm going to link everything down below in the description box for you guys. And be sure to follow me on all of my social medias, on Instagram, TikTok, everything is at Amanda Diaz. I love you all and I will see you in my next video. Bye.